In 2018, we left all we had ever known behind in Florida to make our way to Alaska in an attempt to drive our truck camper from Alaska to Argentina. We made it to the top of the world and turned south only to confront one challenge after another. But along the way, we fell in love with the road and realized that our call to wander would need an RV with a little more space. So we sold our truck camper and purchased a 22-year-old Class C motorhome that needed just a little bit of TLC. This is the story of how we spent six months remodeling our new home on the road. Lindsay. Yeah. Welcome back. What day is it? It's Tuesday. It's, but what day is it? It's Tuesday. I know it's Tuesday, but... Day is it? Oh, oh, it's demo day. Demo day. Demo day. I got a hammer. It looks like I'm hammering you right now. Is that what happened to your nose? Yeah, we got in a fight. No, we didn't get in a fight. You can't say that. When, you, when you live in small spaces, you know, things happen. Right? Yeah, something like that. No. I didn't do that to her. I did not just hammer her in the it's face. It's a funny story. I got in a fight with a cooler, and the cooler won. So my pretty face is messed up and now you're going to have to look at me for the next few weeks with a band-aid on my nose because you do not want to see what's underneath the band-aid, I promise you. Is it your nose? It's that, under the band-aid. That'd be my guess. <laughs> yes, but there's a <laughs> gnarly, something gnarly on my nose. So, so welcome you. back to Called to Wander. We have taken a little break as we are sitting in our brand new... To us. Used... RV, gently used, 47,000 miles. Take a good look at it right now, because we are sitting in the 90s, and by the time we're done, it's going to be nice and modern. Oh, nice and modern. <laughs> Hopefully. You're going to throw that southern accent back on there? Yeah. All right, so we are, we are glad we are back. These are going to be some fun episodes where we don't really know what's going to happen. We do know we're not driving. That's, no. that's a given, so don't expect to see... All those beautiful images and videos of us Zero. all in Baja no. beaches and all that stuff. Not going to happen. This time last year. Awesome. Check out the videos right there. Oh, that looks like in your nose. <laughs> right, right there. Right there. <laughs> Check out our Baja series season two. Um, it's a great, great season. Fantastic. It was our winter last year. This winter we are remodeling our RV. And so we're going to take you along that journey. Have some fun videos of us trying to figure out what in the heck we're doing. And uh, today is demo day, so let's talk yes. really quickly so about excited. demo day. I'm so excited. She's so excited. Ah, oh, I get to and you rip just can't everything hide it. out. <laughs> to rip all this beautiful '90s decor out. So we're ripping this beautiful '90s decor yes. out. Beautiful. Let's talk Don't about that. Trash. As we look around the living room right now, I see cabinets. Yeah. Any cabinets come out. Wood cabinets. Wood cabinets They're are coming, coming out. out. Not the actual the, cabinet the themselves, the doors. Yeah, the doors are coming off. Yeah, the cabinets are pretty awesome. Solid yeah. wood. Yeah, it's nice. And they're getting painted. All the um, pull-out cabinets are coming out. Yep, all getting painted. And what do you think about this? This is pretty, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know. We might keep it. This, oh, you can't see it. Where is it? It's not. We're not keeping it? No. Look at that. Gosh, it's gorgeous. This flower... And the teal, I mean, gorgeous, right? What about the window stuff right here? No, it's all the going. Shades. It doesn't work. It's all going. What about that bug? Stop. No. No, no the bug right there. <laughs> it's going. It's going in the trash. Okay. <laughs> it's gone. So this is demo day, and I'm, I'm excited. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. I don't need a hammer. We're not hammer demoing no. anything. We're just basically unscrewing everything that's screwed in. So, unscrewing everything, ripping up the carpet. Oh, the carpet. Yeah. That's going to be a dirty job. The carpet. We're going to be ripping up the carpet, mm -hmm. putting new wood flooring down. We've got beautiful vinyl plank flooring. Gonna Super be awesome. excited. We're ripping up the carpet in the bedroom as well. Yep. So, we'll expose all of that. And, uh, yeah, so Hopefully pretty much. Hopefully, we aren't surprised by anything. Yeah, when we get done with this, we should have a pretty empty... Mm -hmm. RV. I mean, it's going to be full. I'm looking around. It's going to be full of all the stuff, but it's going to be empty of... All right. Yeah. So we get started? Let's get started. You want to get started? Yes. What's I'm first? Ready. Taking off the cabinet doors. With a hammer? No. With the... No hammer. 
we're gonna get started because she said so. Lindsay's boss of these projects, if you didn't know. Just what, 30 minutes or so? Yeah. Got the balances off here, curtains off in there, all the doors are off, except for the bottom cabinets. The thing with any RV or anything in general is if you see it put together, that means it came apart and it was put together. So you can always break things apart and make them what you need them to be. That's a good rule to know because I've broken a lot of stuff and you gotta learn to fix it so everything comes apart we could even if we wanted to we could take all this stuff off but we don't want to yeah, we're just looking it. at it there's four screws one two three there and then there's a bunch of screws that go across here and so we could mm -hmm. take it all apart but we don't want to we just know that i think we're gonna try to take that one out i think that's all we're gonna take out everything comes so. apart yep yeah. and the microwave we're gonna keep out Figure out what to do with that space. Looking good. Looking good. Try to keep everything uh, marked up. That's the smart thing to do. And wall screws in case we need some of these later on. We also know how thick the walls are. So We've got ourselves a little factory of getting rid of the hinges and the struts so we unscrewed the light fixtures Lindsay's going to paint all up underneath here mm -hmm. and I think we just made an executive decision about this yeah it's covered you tell them it's I don't covered. know, it's covered in something. It's covered know. in like this like fake leather. I think it's deer skin. <laughs> material and it's sticky it, and it's dirty. And we weren't sure, like we were just going to leave it. I think it's albino deer. No. Yeah, that's what it is. It's, it's rare. So if you want to buy it, we'll sell this to you. $300. For $300 a pound. A pound? Yeah. $300 <laughs> a yard. However you sell stuff <laughs> like this. Um, so these... It looks like they come out pretty easy. Pretty sure there's plywood underneath the material. So we're going to take these out, we're going to unscrew it, and then we're going to take the material off the plywood so we keep the same shape because this was a fantastic job. Look at how perfectly curved oh, that's that amazing. is. It's like right over, well that would be my head because you're going to be driving. <laughs> so I don't want to lose that and then we'll, we'll put the wood back and then we'll be able to put I think it'll make it an accent wall. Yeah, we'll put wood paneling going up there. Yeah. And that'll look sharp because everything else will be white. Have like a wood accent wall. Yeah. That's what we're thinking. We so, think it might look good. Yeah, we're making progress. We are. We're going to tape, tape this off with plastic so that everything down there stays paint free. Because Lindsay got a paint gun. We bought a paint spray gun! Lindsay's going to have fun with that. She's going to make a mess. I can see that. <laughs> so because of that, I'm leaving her to do all the taping. I am not good with details. If you haven't figured that out yet, taping plastic around this window yeah, I'm is like my, night that's my nightmare. It's going to be so, awful. I think that's going to be the worst part. I think honestly. I'll take the carpet up in the bedroom while she's working out here because I, I don't want to be around that. I'm not, I'm not good with details. I think I'd rather tape than pull up the carpet. <laughs> I think that's going to be a dirty job. Yeah. Well, that's why we're a team. That's why you need teammates. Close? I think so. Voila. Look at that. 
Oh, so uh, it's particle board. Just half a million staples along here. It's not here. even any good under there. Yeah. And that goes to the to the outside. outside. So, put this wood back up. Take all these staples out. Put the wood back up, and then put whatever we want on the. Yeah, because we have to leave this up. Yeah. Yeah. I'm dreading this part. I've got to take the sofa off, and as you can see, our heater is down here, and then there's our seat belts back there. Mm -hmm. I don't know if the other person knew they had seat belts. We're going to store our batteries back underneath there eventually, but i got to take this apart. So I know this piece just lifts off of here, but i got to disconnect, so I've unscrewed these. I've got to disconnect the heater so I can lift this up and take this away and then see what other bolts are around for me to start taking things apart because it looks like looks like there's really two points on the hinge here that this whole thing would lift off but I'm not really certain so that's what I'm going to do now is figure out how how it comes apart at it the more I think it'd be super easy to actually build ourselves a bench it's just a frame yeah and then something sits on top yeah and we just put big pillows in the we back just put big pillows on it and are you gonna visit us and sleep on our couch I don't think so <laughs> we're not having any guests I don't have kids I've not watched any videos to see how kids live in these places so I don't know where you would put a kid but I'm not going to make decisions for me based on maybe three days that we have a guest. What? Spiders hanging over your head. Oh, man, that's ugly. <laughs> I'm sorry. Why did um, you... I just saw them. <laughs> Hi, Pummer Spider. Sorry. You got to go. We don't... Whoa, we, whoa, whoa. We don't deal with spiders or snakes. I almost fell. We can handle pretty much everything else, but spiders and snakes... <laughs> So what I'll do before I take this out mm -hmm. is I will crawl underneath there and see if there happens to be anything that these are bolted to right. on the underside. But what I'm thinking is, I say, my vote for the record, since you are the record, is my vote is we take this thing out. What did you do, Chris? Just, no. You know, I was just... Um, Why did you do that? I saw some bolts, and I'm a boy, and... But where do those bolts go to? Well, they went here, but now they what? don't. But what's underneath? I don't know. Oh my gosh. But... What are we going to do? Look, the sofa's out. Completely. Completely. And... Uh... Wow. Yeah, And where out. are we going to put that? <laughs> I think... I think this is nice. I think we're on to something here. Yeah. Watch me complain when I have to actually build. Yeah, and it's gonna cost money. Well, it's gonna cost money. <laughs> like, you know what else is gonna cost money? What? Your pillowcase covers. Yep. For your throwaway pillows. That I'm gonna buy with my money. Oh, you put it and in the budget. And that you're gonna wanna lay your head on. You put it in the budget. I sure did. You put it in the budget. That's our money then. That's not your money. <laughs> no, I did it so That's, you wouldn't be able to tell me no. The budget is our money. Because even if it wasn't in the budget, if, I'd spend my own money on it. If you them. just magically show up with it, that's your money. But when you put it in the budget, that's our money. <laughs> We're having a good time. This is fun. And uh, let's get on to the next thing. Alright. Oh. That face doesn't look good. I know, but <laughs> I just pulled up the whole wall with it. I told you to be careful. I know, but what else am I supposed to do? I, do I need to cut it every now and then? Yeah, cut it now. Okay. Razor blade? Shasta, you did too good of a job. Stick on this dang wall. Right, 
Oh. I'm oh, tired. Oh man, I'm exhausted. What a day one. Mm. Demo day. Yep. Almost done. We did a demo good job. Yeah, we did. Get it? Demo good job. A demo good job. Yeah. That was like, I was going to use profanity, but I don't use profanity. Mm -hmm. Unless we break down. Yeah. We did a demo good job. We sure did. We are, um, we're done for the day. Mm. It's been, uh, hours. Got a lot more done, I think, in some ways than I thought. Mm -hmm. Like, the sofa's gone. Yeah, I didn't expect yeah. that to die. <laughs> That's fun. Um, but... We are on a roll. We also didn't get some stuff done that I thought. I thought we'd be all taped up by today. Yeah, no, that didn't but happen. There are some things we found we're going to need to do to add some extra steps. A little bit of sanding some of the screw holes. Mm -hmm. And throw in some, um, what's putty. it called? Yeah, putty. And then you can paint properly and it'll look good. Yeah, because we want to do it right. We're going to yeah. do yeah. the job the right way. And then we are going to be, I guess, taping and painting tomorrow. Yep. And I'll be working on the carpet. And it is going to be another fun, fantastic semi-demo day. Yeah. Demo and paint prep day. Mm-hmm. And maybe even painting. Yeah. You might get to paint. I might be done by the end of this week with painting. Yeah. Well, I hope so. Yeah. Painting and floor. Because, see, while we're doing this, you're not working. And yeah, I'm not working. Mm-hmm. And we got to work. Yeah, we got to make money. So we got to do this But quick. it was good that we did work this past week and we, yep. we made some money. So now we got to work on this mm -hmm. as fast as we can so we can get back to working and working. And working. That's what we do. We work. Anyway... Working nine to five. What's at the car wash? <laughs> no, it's at, Dolly Parton. Sorry. Uh, at, the, at the car wash. Working nine to five. At I don't know the other wash. words. <laughs> it's at the car wash. No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> I promise. Whatever it is, we don't work nine to five. We work crazy hours, but we're gonna go ahead and wrap for the night, and then we will pick back up tomorrow with semi demo paint prep day, mm -hmm. and yeah, so. What do, we, what do we say that? I can't wait to see what it looks like. All pretty. All pretty. If you have enjoyed this video, we appreciate you hitting the like button. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so. It's getting exciting again. And of course, share this video and our story with your friends and family. Leave us a comment about anything positive, positive, positive. And uh, if you have any questions or whatever, let us know. We appreciate you being part of our journey. In this, a wild new chapter. And on that note, we will see you next time. <laughs> you broke the camera, Lindsay. Oh, man. Lindsay, you broke the Good camera. Thing it's under warranty. Under warranty? Yep. Why'd you break the camera? I don't know. My oh. face broke it. Why would you do that? It's pretty ugly right now. Your broke face broke the camera? <laughs> yes.